Question number three, Ruth McGuire. Thank you, Presiding Officer. To ask the Scottish Government how it plans to invest in supporting youth culture in the Cunningham South constituency. Cabinet Secretary. The Scottish Government places great importance on cultural activity in the local community, and we believe that young people of all backgrounds should have the opportunity to access quality cultural services in their local area. The Scottish Government supports a range of organisations through Creative Scotland. In the Cunningham South constituencies, these include the Irvine and Dreghorn Brass Band and Music Education Partnership, We Make Music Libraries Group, which caters to young people specifically. And we also provide upwards of £190,000 in support of North Ayrshire Council's highly regarded youth music initiative programme based in Cunningham, whose work reaches all schools in the local authority area. Ruth McGuire. Thank the Cabinet Secretary for that answer, and I welcome that the Scottish Government is increasing funding in culture. Arts and culture are an integral part of a thriving community. This summer, I had the pleasure of visiting Impact Arts, where I saw firsthand the vital work that they are doing to provide artistic opportunities for young people, the positive impact it had on their well-being, and the prospects it opened up to them. Does the Cabinet Secretary agree with me that money invested by the Scottish Government through Creative Scotland should be distributed across the country? for the benefit of all, ensuring that the arts are developed for young people outside of our main cities. Cabinet Secretary. We know that it is vital to nurture culture and creativity across all of Scotland's communities, and the funding uh, that we provide via Creative Scotland reaches individuals, reaches organisations, reaches projects right across the whole of Scotland. Uh, for example, our long-standing investment of over £150 million since 2007 in the Youth Music Initiative continues to support and empower young people in all of Scotland's 32 local authorities, allowing them to access music-making and learning opportunities, with every pupil being offered a year's free music tuition by the end of primary school. 